In this video, I'm going to show you how you can rent and buy movies on your Xbox console. So here we are on my Xbox dashboard. I'm going to show you step by step how to find, buy and rent movies on your Xbox. The first thing we want to do is to find the Xbox store. By pressing the home button, you will open up a side menu and scrolling down to the bottom of the side menu, right in the center, you will see the store. We could enter the store by pressing A here, or we can do this via the home. If you press B, we're back on the home page and scrolling down once, twice, you will find the store. Press A to enter your Xbox Microsoft Store. Now at this point, we need to find where the films slash movies are located within the Xbox Microsoft Store on your Xbox console. Moving to the left will open up the side menu. And you can see that if we scroll down twice, there is films and TV. When hovering on the film and TV section, you will then open up a subcategory. For example, movies and TV home, new film releases, top rented films, featured films, browse TV, and movies and TV specials. For the purpose of this video, we're going to start by looking through the new film releases. Press A. This will then show you newly released films available for buying and renting on your Xbox One. You may have already noticed that while we are hovering on Mulan here, it says from $9.99. Stick to the end of this video and I will explain how the pricing model works when you're buying and renting movies here on your Xbox console. You can see that there is a selection of newly released films in this section. I will be showing you how to find more films for you to buy and rent on your Xbox. But there is a great selection here that you can find on newly released movies. You can also see that as we hover over a movie, a trailer is being given and the first thing you would see with the trailer is the age certificate of that film. Let's press B to go back to the home page. Why here, scroll to the left, find the movies and TV section, and let's open another subcategory of movies and TV media. Let's go for top rented films. Top rented films are the films that are rented the most by Xbox users. Beware, if you are looking for family friendly content and maybe you have somebody that's of young age with you while you're searching through these movies, when looking through these specific categories, genres are mixed up. Meaning, next to a horror film, you may have a child friendly film. Remember that trailers do automatically play on screen when you hover over a movie. So if you have somebody young with you, be quick on your controller in order to avoid something being shown that may be too explicit for somebody who is under age. But do not worry, Anthony Allen has the solution. Press B to go back to the home page and let's select search. Here you can search for specific films that you may be looking for. For example, let's search for Mulan. You can search for your favourite film to see if it's available for renting or buying on your Xbox. Here we have multiple Mulan films for us that we can buy or rent. For example, Mulan 2 is a movie that I have not watched. It's available from 9 99 we can see that this is a film by the film or movie icon at the bottom of the piece of media. Once you've found your movie, press A on the piece of media. You will then find this page. It says buy in UHD, choose a format, and we're going to select choose a format. You can see that there are three different formats of this movie. UHD, HD and SD. We're going to select SD. You can see that the pricing has now changed to $9.99 to buy this movie in SD format. 
scrolling down will show you additional information on the movie. You will also see more information on your formats. So for example, a UHD media format for this movie is only suitable for the Xbox Series One X or Xbox Series One S that is running on a 4K TV. This page is mega important for those of you who are buying your media, your movies, via the Xbox console. As if you purchase the wrong format, it may not be suitable for your TV setup or console setup. There is also this really cool page where you can look at the cast and crew of the movie. This can give you additional information that you may not have known about the movie that you are looking to buy. For example, I did not know that Donnie Young plays the commander here in this Mulan movie. And there is also Jet Li who plays the Emperor and Jason Scott Lee who plays Khan, who's also known for the 90s movie Mortal Kombat. You can actually go through the cast and crew, including the director and which actors are featured within the film. You can also have a look at what else is included with your purchase. For example, here included in is a bonus and you can see what that bonus entails by watching these trailers. You can also scroll down to see what people also like. So people are watching these movies, but they also made a secondary purchase on things such as Maleficent, Frozen 2, Onwards, Jumanji, Sonic. What you may have noticed is once we've made an initial selection or a choice and you've scrolled down to the section of people also like, you will find movies that are in the same age rating or within the same genre as what you have initially selected. For example, Mulan is a Disney film and you can now see other Disney films that people also like. For example, Lion King, which was released in 2019 here. We're going to make the selection and I'll show you more information once we've made the selection of how you make your purchase. So here is the purchase page. I will be censoring some of this information as my billing details are showing on screen. This is what your purchase page will look like to buy or rent a movie. It will give you the subtotal and then it will give you a total which includes VAT and then it is showing you how you are going to pay. You can also have a look at the terms. So it's also valid to mention that when you are making digital purchases because this is now in your possession most of these purchases will be non-refundable. So make sure that you have made a selection that is suitable for you before deciding to buy or rent a movie. And that is my two pence on the terms and conditions of purchasing digital products online. Again, just like before, we can have a look at the cast and crew. We can have a look at what's included with the purchase along with the movie. But you can also have a look at the ratings and reviews of other people that have watched the movie. Again, you can scroll down to people also like to find additional movies within the same genre or suitable movies for your age rating of the initial film that you have selected. If this video has been helpful to you or you found it interesting, give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button so that you can help YouTube understand that you have enjoyed this content and so that I can find more people online and help them with videos that I create like this. Don't go anywhere because I have content for you that you will enjoy and you will find a recommended video on my channel in the end card of this video. I'll see you in the next video.